Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome back to part two, playing here at Costa Navarino at the International Olympic Course. Here in Greece, I did really well on my front nine. I got seven over, I think that is, I'm gonna say a record for me because I never score. So I actually don't know what my golf level actually is because I play proms and I play scrambles and I play everything that is not just playing 18 and I have to film every time I play. I just rolled my eyes. I actually love filming but it did sound just like that and I don't. I love it. So look at this backdrop by the way. This is how we're starting hole nine. I can't believe it. I feel blessed. Hole ten. This is how we're starting hole ten. Thank you for reminding me. Uh, clearly I've lost my brain cells. Also, the back nine is where I kind of tend to lose a little bit because I get a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. <laughs> I get a little bit like jelly, as you can tell from my, and in a, uh. I'm gonna just hit the ball now. All right, let's do this. Hole 10, 332 yards. You can see the flag at the back going straight down the middle. That did not roll at all. I was trying to get a bit more of a fade on it because I've been going a bit the opposite of a fade and when I get tired I do the opposite of fade. Not quite a slice but probably people would call it a slice. Anyway, I'm trying to do the opposite and it just worked. Got about 115-ish yards. I'm going to go for a nine because I just feel like it's the right play. Oh, please don't go in the bunker. No! How did it bounce at the bunker? That's so mean. Oh, yeah. Oh, woohoo, that was amazing. <laughs> that was so good for me. I am not that great out of bunker. That view is just something else. Even if I miss it, I'm kind of happy that I've got a lovely view behind me. Oh, no. Still a bogey. That was very dramatic, sorry. <laughs> Par five, hole 11, 422 yards. There's loads of bunkers over there. So I'm gonna see if I can play a little bit right. Oh yeah. Oh no. We'll find out where that went. You can see the pin is like to the right. So I'm gonna play up towards that bunker and then hopefully have a nice line in. Just as I said I was going to do. Got about 120 yards to the pin, but the pin's at the front and the space at the back. So I'm taking an eight because I've been hitting short all day. And nothing's been rolling. And we've got a bunker at the front. Oh, that was good. Oh, oh what? <gasps> I went over the bunker again. Oh, she did another magic bunker shot. Oh my God, oh my God, don't in the hole. <gasps> I don't know. I need the thingy. <gasps> that was crazy. Oh my God. What is happening? Right, that was exceptional for me. What the hell? Right, I just can't give this away. Ooh. Heart racing. That is a par, my friends. Oh my God. This view is unbelievable. This has to be the nicest course I think I've ever played in my life. This is hole seven. It's got water, it's got trees, it's got mountains, it's got golf, it's got everything that you could possibly want in life that would make you happy. I am speechless for once. We've got 130 yards to the pin, but the pin is right at the front and there's a bunker ahead. I'm gonna use a seven nine because I think I'd rather be back than forward. And I've been playing it short. Oops, no, not in the bunker. Yay. Roll. That is a very long putt, but it's okay. We're all good. Interestingly, this is not easy at all. There's a massive ridge here, and there's another one down there. I'm gonna play it slightly left, I think. I feel, if it goes that way, I'm, pfft, God knows what's gonna happen. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that was not the way I was expecting it to go. Whoa, that was way better than I expected. That all went wrong, but it all went right. Oh, that was very, very, very annoying. Oh, 
At least we got a bogey. I, that wasn't the greatest shot from the tee, but I think I recovered quite well. Got the 13th hole here, 360 yards to the pin. Beautiful mountains right in front of me. I'm gonna avoid those bunkers on the right if I can. I don't even know why I mentioned that. I should not even have said anything, should I? I shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. I think I'm in the bunker, but like, playing with fire, Mia Baker. Looks a bit scary down there for some reason. It feels like I'm gonna fall off the edge of a cliff. Maybe I might. The flag is really, really right. I'm gonna go for the green, and then I can putt from wherever. Well, I went far away as possible. I guess we are on the green. It's a very long putt though. This is a crazy long putt with a few breaks. I'm a bit confused, I'm not going to lie. I'm thinking... Oh, I need help. Okay, let's just, if in doubt, always go straight. That's what I was told. I'm in doubt. Turn, turn, turn. Not that way. Yes, that way. More. That's a long par putt, but crazier things have happened. Oh, turn, turn, turn. Oh, I thought I was going to go. So close. It's a little bit less hard. Another bogey for Baker. 14th hole, we've got 310 yards to the pin. There's a load of bunkers on the right, so I'm gonna try and play a little bit left to give me a bit of a nicer shot in, hopefully, is the plan. If I could carry the bunkers, I'd be living my best life, but I can't, so we're living my second best life. Oh, that was about as good as I can get, to be honest. I really hope that's landed somewhere good. Thought I was gonna get bit as I hit that. <laughs> Little bad bad. Got about 30 yards to the pin here. So I'm gonna try and roll it up. Go. Oh, I thought I was going to hit over that little edge and then it was going to roll and trickle to the hole and I just missed it by that much. Come see, come see. That is another bogey for Baker. We've got our first, what feels like short par four. We've got about 280 odd yards to the pin. I don't think I'm good enough to hit the bunkers. So I'm just going to go play a straight driver. Is that a silly, silly thing to do? Try to play a soft driver shot. Might have worked, you know. I really did play with fire. I'm literally right on the edge of the bunker here. Got about 75 yards to the pin. I'm going to play right to the green because it's obviously super close to the bunkers on the right. And my miss is kind of centre to the right. So if I go centre, it should be good. We're on the green. This is gonna be super downhill. It's gonna go mega, mega fast. Maybe ah, a touch right to left at the end because of the slope of the green. So I'm gonna to go touch left to right. But I think it's mostly gonna be about pace here, to be honest. Ooh, that was so good. Yay, she got another puff. 16th hole, par three, we've got about 165 yards to the pin. I am pulling my five iron now. I am desperate, desperate, desperate to become its best friend. I'm gonna aim slightly left because everything does slope right and my miss is right. So I just think, wow, look at that. <laughs> that is exceptional. Oh my God. The crazy thing is you probably never think of Greece as being like a golfing destination. To be honest, I never even thought about coming to Greece. It wasn't like, it just wasn't one of those tastes people talk about. But here I am looking at this and I'm thinking, damn, this is a hidden gem. Oh no, please grab the bunker. Okay, I'm happy in the bunker. <laughs> Sit. Ooh, 
we're out. It's gonna be an interesting par putt. Pretty slopey, kind of hard to read. I'm gonna go for like a straight putt. I'm really bad at these, this is where I need a bit of help. I don't know where it's gonna go. Too many bumps, too many bumps in the road. <gasps> Slow-mo. Slow that was in slow-mo. Another bogey. God's sake, maybe. I can't believe we nearly got that part. That would have been wild. That would have been so crazy. I feel like there's so many holes where I was just so close to getting a par or even a birdie. Knocking on that door. So par five, we've got 446 yards to the pin. There's quite a lot of bunkers, but the straight bunker is a bit too far away. I actually won't hit it. So I'm gonna aim for that. Oh no, not in that bunker, please. Oh. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. This could be the greatest score I've ever scored. Cause I don't actually score very much, but like, Ever. We have something very funky ahead of us. I'd need to be able to carry it 177 to get over it, which realistically is not gonna happen. So I'm gonna go for like, I think a pitching wedge, lay up, and then hit my next shot. Cause clever me, I would do that. They don't feel very fun to do cause it feels like it's not gone anywhere, but like it's the right thing to do. I just felt very like, 150 yards, seven, a good six would be good. I'm gonna go for a seven. I don't know, maybe it's not enough. But it's a good seven. I hit good seven. <laughs> well, that was lucky six, not in the bunker. Always happen, right at the end. Right, Mia, keep your composure. You're not lost yet. I'm gonna hit a full approach shot wedge out of the bunker here. It's about 70 odd yards. Oh, that was good. My bunker game today has just been out of this world. This is my par part. Yes, yes, woohoo. I am so happy. <laughs> Oh my God. Like that's wild to me. I hit the worst seven iron of my life. It went into the bunk. I hit the best approach shot ever. And then I just The final hold, hole 18, 338 yards to the pin. I'm not gonna tell you my exact score right now. I'm gonna wait until the end because I don't wanna jinx it. You know what I'm saying? We just gotta play this hole, play it our best, do what we can. And what will be, will be. Good work. Got about 130 yards to the pin. I'm getting excited. I'm trying to keep my like adrenaline levels level. Um, obviously the pin again is tucked away behind these bunkers in the front. So I'm gonna try and play it straight and then I should have a nice little putt into the pin. Is the plan anyway. Oh, spin it. To win it. Turn left, bounce left, bounce left. Please bounce left. I was really trying not to jinx anything. Okay, let's keep going, let's keep going. I was contemplating whether I putted or chipped, but I just felt like I just have more chance with my putter. And then it makes me feel like I've got two putts. So I feel like I'm playing for like a birdie putt now, which I am anyway, but I just, oh. Okay, Mia, keep it together, girl. Go, 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 more, more, more. Ooh, that's gonna be a tricky little par putt. Okay, I got bogey, I got bo well, let's, let's get it in first. I've just got bogey. I think I have just scored the greatest round of my life. I'm gonna go and calculate the numbers now from part one of this video and part two. I am so happy. All right, my scores from the International Olympic Academy Golf Course here in Costa Navarino. Never played it before, first time ever. Played off the blue tees, which is equivalent to like the yellows back in the UK. And on the front nine, which obviously if you watch my previous video, you'll know that I got seven over, which is pretty darn good for me. I mean, I personally think I'm like, I don't know, like a 50 handicap, because I just never play. Anyway, seven over on the front nine. On the back nine, we got six over, which means I got a grand total of 13 over. And I've never done that before in 80. That's like less than 18 shots on 
a golf course. Like, I have never done that before. Granted, I don't play enough. I just like practice and do bits and bobs here and play golf. Like, I just enjoy golf when I play it. And I get quite, I get quite stressed when I play on a golf course. And today, I felt relaxed, I felt happy. I was in like a glorious backdrop and we scored our best round ever. Thank you everybody. Thank you guys for watching and <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. I'm gonna go and celebrate now because I am very happy. I'm actually catching a flight home. So I'm gonna go home and tell all my friends and all my family who probably don't care. But anyway, I will catch up with you guys soon. Bye.